The following portion of Daytime Blue Ridge is sponsored by... With Father's Day coming up right around the corner, Virginia Distillery Company is joining us to make some cocktails that Dad will definitely love. Yeah, joining us now is Amanda Beckwith, the guest experience and education manager from Virginia Distillery Company, to make a couple of cocktails and talk about an upcoming event. Thanks so much for coming on. Thanks for having me. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about Virginia Distillery Company. Virginia Distillery Company is a single malt whiskey distillery in Lovingston, Virginia, and we are making our own single malt on site. We have barley growing in the field, cool. and we have tours and tastings available every day, so we love to have the public out too. Oh, cool. All awesome. right, so you have a cask society and we a do. cask club. What That's is that? That's right. Well, our goal is education and just bringing people on board, getting them to fall in love with whiskey. So, our cask society is a really cool opportunity. You can actually buy into a barrel or buy your own barrel of whiskey, which is really fun. And That's we also really have something called the Copper Circle, so you can be part of a whiskey club, too. Hey, and that's pretty cool. bottles on a quarterly basis, it's really great. Awesome. Yeah. Okay. And you are making a couple of cocktails. I am, We yes. can get into the first one and we'll just kind of ask you questions okay. as we go. So sure. what's the first one we're going to so make? So the first one is a summery riff on a Manhattan. Okay. And it's very easy. You can make it at home. Typically, I would say add ice at the end because you don't want it to dilute your cocktail, but we're saving time right here. Okay. And uh, we start with our whiskey, an ounce and a half of our port cask finished Virginia Highland whiskey mm -hmm. right there. And then we finish it with uh, about an ounce of vermouth and I like to use a sweet vermouth so for me that's going to be right here okay, okay. And right up okay. and then um, Manhattan's are a lot of fun because you can do a lot of things with bitters or kind of sweeten it up to play sure. with it okay so for us our sweetener today is going to be something that we call um, a cherry liqueur and okay. uh, you can use different types for us um, this is Luxardo and we're going to just do an Half an ounce. Okay. Right there on top. Looks and then I talked about the bitters that you can have fun with. For yeah. us right now, um, we're doing some chocolate bitters. These are hot cocoa, so they've got cayenne Whoa, in there. Whoa, that's a couple cool. drops. Oh, oh hot, hot cocoa yes. in the hot, hot is cayenne. Cocoa is the cayenne, exactly. I like yeah, that. which is really mm -hmm. fun. Okay. And uh, yeah, you can do orange, you can do all sorts of things. Uh, we've done coffee bitters, which is really great. Cool. And yeah, just stir it up, chill it a little bit, get that going. Yeah. And after about 30 seconds, you've got everything mixed in really well. That was okay. easy. It right. is super easy. Okay. And then you just strain and pour into whatever glass you'd like. And uh -huh. we're going to do a more classic one today right over here. So okay. this is our whiskey forward take on a summery light Manhattan. Oh, it's beautiful. Yes. That's pretty easy. How pretty yes. that is. Dad's okay. going to love that. Okay, yeah. so our next one is what? Yes. Our next one is going to be something called the Pineapple Express. And so that for us is going to, again, start with our, our whiskey. This time, two ounces of it. Okay. So right in there with the ice. Okay. And then we're going to follow it up with a pineapple liqueur. Just half an ounce okay. and uh, yeah, it's really light and uh, sweet. So that's your sweetener right there. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you can do um, different types of vermouth. I like a bittersweet, but in this case right now I'm going to do a little bit more of our, um, our sweet vermouth. So okay. I'm going to do that from right down here. Okay. Since I just found out this can't be done on air. <laughs> Um, so that goes right in. And again, for bitters, you can do um, orange bitters. That's really light and zesty, brings in the citrus notes. Mm -hmm. So just a couple dashes, and uh, you're good to go. So awesome. these are Angostura orange. Yes, the same thing. We're going to stir it up a little bit and strain, and then uh, this is your... And really you actually have an event for dads coming Ooh. up, right? Yes, this is going to be this Saturday on the 16th. It's called Dads Love Dram. Okay. And we have a food truck, and we have a band, and it's just uh, a great way to come out and celebrate the, the dad in your life or yes. just friends. It's um, it's something that we do every single month, so you can check out our website, va.distillery.com. Yeah, very And uh, also our Facebook page. All right, we will cool. check it Thank out. You. Thank you. Thank you so much. And uh -huh. happy Father's Day to dads everywhere. Yeah.